take a look behind the scenes of Stories That Soar at Cragen Elementary. Like a lot of people these days, Stories That Soar meets over Zoom. We are as safe as possible when we produce your stories, so in this show you saw a lot of our family members and a lot of our pets. In the few pieces where we really needed people in the scene together, we used a green screen. Now what is a green screen? It's a big piece of green fabric. Actors stand in front of a green or sometimes blue screen to make backgrounds disappear. In editing, you remove the color green or blue because it isn't the color of human or animal skin. You erase the background and the actors stay. You can put anything behind them. Like in Sisters VR, where the sisters are running through the video game. Here's an example of pets and green screen. We green screen the cats that wound up on Cat Planet. Ah, uh, the smell. Moving on. In this scene, we used green and blue screen. We filmed the Magic Box family in front of a green screen. We used a blue screen to remove the background for the man at the fair because if you look closely, his hat has some green in it. If we had used a green screen, it would have taken that part of his hat away when we took away the background, and that would look pretty silly. And speaking of silly... Chicken! Chick-fil-A! Oh, George, I'm sorry! And so did George! Ying, are you paying attention? You too. I think I'm doing her. You put the TV? George, you gotta help me out one more time here, kid. <sighs> Come on, George. One more time. I know! There was plenty of live action, but we had lots of animation in this show as well. This particular animation had 459 frames in it. That means there were 459 pictures drawn to tell this story. Our family members pitched in to help. Here, you'll see Deborah and her two sisters while they were filming Sisters VR. Tiffany has acted with us for years, and all three of her children were featured in this show. Little Rosemary was in Cursed Baby and Karate. Zaylee narrated and did all of the writing for Moving to Tucson. Also, we had family members from around the country send us pictures of locations that were listed in Moving to Tucson. And Corbin, who played Baby Box and was also in Karate. Fun fact, once Corbin's dad played an angry magic box in a Stories at Soar show. Wow, what a great adventure! I really liked it. I think George did too. <laughs> we enjoyed the adventure and we hope you did too. Thanks for watching.